Good morning. It's Blog 315. Big day ahead, full of cool car stuff. But before I get to that, Kathy is sending me up into town to go get dishwashing detergent. At least I get to take a cool car. sunny day to be driving a cool car. Got the Malibu Guitar Festival a little bit later, and then after that I got an event at OLM tonight, Havana Nights. It's gonna be an awesome, awesome day. Guitar Festival's gonna start in about an hour or so. Go get something to eat first. Guitar Festival with Diane Peterson, my stunt friend and badass. That's right. Eating cookies. Eating cookies. We just went in, got Yummy. some photos, hung out with Kenny Wayne Shepherd, watched him play a little bit. And now we're hanging out here because the cookies are out here. That's right. Great day at the Guitar Fest. We're going in soon. <laughs> Dealers, they're the first band that goes up. Rockin'. Yes. Alright, the Connor dealers are about to go on. They're so good. Hello everyone. Can everyone hear me out there? Here we go. Yeah. So for those of you in front of the stage, I know you grab some great seats, but we have two stages running this year. We're about to start, this is our second stage, so there's music going back and forth all day, all day long, from there to here to there to here. So anyway, for those of you, for the hardcores that got here early, thank you very much, very impressive. I want to welcome you all to the second annual Malibu Guitar Festival, and we're very, very excited to be back again and again and again and again. So we're going to kick this thing off right. We have one of our favorites here, our local and dear friends, the Karma Dealers. And I'm going to introduce them in a second, but I just want to say these guys are here in Malibu. They're playing music every day. They're playing everywhere. They're the best. They're promoters. They push this guitar festival. They love it because it's theirs. It's everybody's in the community. So please put your hands together for our friends, the Karma Dealers.
for a while don't have a lot of time so I got a few other things to do before I head over to the other event but so far amazing performances It's about four o'clock. I went back to the house, did a few things. But now I'm back in the Oldsmobile. I'm headed up north on PCH, going to OLM, actually going to the Malibu Jewish Center. I, I think that's where it is. I'm not really sure where it is. I'm gonna find it along the way. in probably 50 or 60 years, I figured I'd pull off for a second on my way to this event and get some shots for you guys. She's a beauty. We are hanging out. Where exactly are we? We're at the uh, Malibu Jewish Center and Synagogue uh, Entertainment Venue, I guess would be the best way to say. Normally, I would be nervous in this position because Michael is principal of OLM and I got in a lot of trouble. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I feel pretty good because he's a car guy and, and loves kids. So uh, tell me what this, this whole thing is, that we're why, why we're here. This is our annual uh, spring fundraiser. It's an auction. Uh, we have items to bid on. We have dinner. We have uh, gambling, dancing. It's just a way to bring the community together to generate extra uh, revenue for the school to nice. help provide the programs for the kids. And we have one car. And we have one car here. But it's really cool. But it is very cool. <laughs> All right. And, it's, and our theme this year is Havana Nights. So Makes sense. Uh, I.E., that's why the car is here. Yeah. So I'm wondering, maybe next year it might be uh, spaceships and science could fiction. Be. You know, could, it, be. It could be. We could have you come in and draw one of, you know. Or fly in. A car, you know. You never know. Absolutely. All right, I don't want to keep you, but uh, this is going to be fun. Absolutely. Okay. So glad you're here, Fred. Okay. First car that you ever owned? Owned? Yes. A 1952 Chevy two door coupe. Nice. What's the worst thing you did in that car? Oh, God. <laughs> worst thing I ever You are did? a principal, remember. You're setting the tone. Worst thing I ever did was to put in an LP uh, record player. That car had no shock, so it was just. <laughs> The it was, album was would skip, no. yeah. You'd drive down and skip, so that was probably the worst thing. Yeah, that's an idea a kid would have, though. Oh, yeah. yeah that's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. We were hanging out with Denise 
Richards at this OLM fundraiser. Spectacular. Hanging out with dogs. <laughs> yes. He's yawning, but we're not. We're having a good time. Okay, your your first car when yes. you were a kid. What was your first car? My first car was a 76 white Volkswagen Bug. Okay, I can visualize that. And, and it had a big ribbon, a big bow. My parents got it for me. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so you didn't have to buy it yourself. I didn't okay. have to buy it. It was, okay. it was very cool. And what, what was the worst thing you did in that car? Uh, well, I got in a car accident, but it was not my fault. Okay. Someone hit my sister and I uh, head on. Uh, and I have to say, it uh, survived okay. Either it would be okay. The car was too good, but we were okay, which was a lot about it. Spectacular event. Big thanks to uh, Principal Michael Smith for inviting me up to this uh, this great fundraiser. Very cool. Had a fun time. I'm going to wrap the vlog up right here, but tomorrow morning we're heading to the Vintage Car Show. So we're going to see lots of really cool cars early in the morning. But this is it for vlog 315. Signing out. We'll see you then.